In 2022, China's automotive market remained in pole position and by a long shot. Ranking ahead of both the US and India, auto sales rose 9.5%. The latest figures show that just under 2 million units were sold in February this year, up 13.5% year on year and up nearly 20% from January. But here at the Hainan Expo, car manufacturers and exhibitors have shifted gears and are riding the new energy vehicle trend. What do you think is the drive behind the pursuit of having more NEVs on our roads? And what is Porsche doing uh, to pursue that? We know there's a lot of support for that here in China. I think the road to electromobility, especially the transformation which we are now undergoing in automotive industry, is irreversible. It's a great thing also to contribute to the environmental protection by actively getting into the topic of CO2 emission reduction. Yeah, so like you said, Porsche is now offering in total 21 derivatives of our overall six model lines as uh, all electric cars and uh, hybrid plug-in. And that irreversible trend that Porsche is looking to be a part of is backed up by the numbers. Sales of gasoline, electric hybrids and pure EVs rose a staggering 93% in 2022 to 6.9 million units. And with EVs making up just over 25% of vehicle sales last year, what are the challenges and opportunities looking forward? What would you say is the biggest challenge to push the NEVs in the Chinese market? What could be uh, improved? What is uh, an obstacle to companies like Porsche? It's a very good question. Um, I think we have a lot of opportunities in this market. We see great potential. Uh, I, would not call, I would not call it challenge. Uh, right now we have seen a lot of local Chinese and EV manufacturers that are bringing into the market at full speed uh, great products and very competitive products. We are excited to be part of this market. Um, but as Porsche, we are also very keen on stick to our core identity because performance, like I mentioned before, performance plus sustainability has always been our main focus. Putting NEVs aside, another emerging trend is van life and vehicles transformed for the Outback. Chinese brand Kawa is here at the Hainan X while showcasing their latest camper. So let's get on board and check it out. Uh, before 10 years in China, people don't think and um, people don't really have the concept of this uh, of this like camping life or like people uh, want to buy the RV or they want to they want to uh, rent the RV to travel around the country, travel around the world. And they have a, a lot of more information about this lifestyle. I think in the future, this is going to be the big trend and this is going to be uh, really, really into everybody's life. The Hainan Expo may well be about a variety of different consumer products, but it's quite clear that China's automotive industry and its consumer market presence is paving the way forward. Omar Khan, CGTN, Heiko.